So here's the pool after a long Maine winter without a cover. So you should use a cover. Okay. So here's the before video. And what I've done is I've used a rake to kind of use it upside down and get the leaves out. It's much easier, much quicker. Let's see. Show you this right here. Make sure it's a plastic one and it's not all busted up so you don't have any sharp ends like that at the end. But if you do it easy, you'll take the bottom of it like this, scoop it, and you'll get leaves out. A lot faster than the other way. Just don't dig at the bottom, you see. Well, anyway, we've already done that part. All right, and then put it in one of these or something so it's not all over the place like this because you don't want to be raking that crap up after. This is the blue cover that we usually have on it every year. I wasn't able to put it on last year. We were going to get a new pool cover. Didn't get around to it. So, this is what we got. Okay, and now I put four bags of shock in. I'm debating to put a fifth bag in. But I think I'm going to let it alone tonight and use the four bags of shock. I'll show you what... It's on the other side, I suppose. I buy the big case of it. No, it's in the bucket. <laughs> Sorry. All right, so let me pause this. This is shock, super shock. This is what you want to use. I bought this big package, which came with six, as you see, and I put four in. So six minus four leaves two. You got it. I have two left for tomorrow if the pool is not cleared right up. I expect to see the pool very cloudy, extremely cloudy, but I expect to see it not green. All right, so tune in tomorrow. Please subscribe. Thank you.